The multi-touch trackpad on the new MacBook and MacBook Pro is unlike anything you've ever seen or touched. For starters, the trackpad is actually made from glass with a silky smooth, touch-friendly surface. The next thing you'll notice is there's no separate button. In fact, the whole trackpad is one big button. This gives you 39% more room for gestures. Thanks to its unique one-button design, you can click anywhere on the trackpad by pressing down. Just point with your finger and click. Press down twice to double-click and open a file or application. Dragging is just as easy. Click and hold the trackpad with your thumb to select an item. Then drag the item by moving your finger. If you're used to using a multi-button trackpad to right-click, or what we call secondary click, you'll love the new multi-touch trackpad. The easiest way to right-click is to just press the trackpad with two fingers. That instantly opens a shortcut menu. You can also customize your trackpad to right-click in either the lower left or lower right corner. Then click the corner you want. The multi-touch trackpad on the new MacBook and MacBook Pro is so smart it can tell the difference between the number of fingers you use and how you use them. Now you can gesture using two, three, and four fingers. Hold two fingers on the trackpad and move them left or right to browse horizontally through a web page or window. Move two fingers down or up to scroll vertically. Hold your thumb and index finger open in the middle of the trackpad and twist clockwise or counterclockwise to rotate a photo. You can also gesture to make images bigger or smaller. Place your thumb and index finger together on the trackpad, then spread them apart to zoom in. Do the reverse and pinch your fingers together to zoom out. Hold three fingers together and swipe left or right to advance back and forth through Safari pages just like you do when you turn the pages of a book. Hold four fingers on the trackpad and swipe up to show a clean desktop when you have a lot of windows open. Then swipe down to bring your windows back. With four fingers, swipe down to see all your open windows. You can then select the one you want by clicking on it. Hold four fingers together and swipe left or right to open the application switcher. Then select the application you want. Now it's easier than ever to configure your trackpad settings. The trackpad has its own pane in System Preferences. You can set up your trackpad just the way you like it, and you can watch video demos of each gesture to learn how to use them. Try out the new multi-touch trackpad on a new MacBook or MacBook Pro at your local Apple Store.